Are you waiting for someone to appear on screen? Do you think the screen is blank? We are going to discuss something we can't see. Guesses. If you want to describe a man, you tell his height, weight, physical features, etc. Which are some measurable properties of a man. Similarly, a gas can be described using physical properties like pressure, volume, temperature, mass, etc. Let's discuss these physical properties which can be used to describe a gas. Pressure is the force applied by gas molecules on walls of the container. It is measured in pascals and atmospheric pressure ATM. Volume is the volume of container in which gas molecules exist. It is measured in liters L. Similarly, mass is the mass of the gas present in the container. It is measured in grams GM. We Indians obey the constitutional laws written by Ambedkar. Similarly, the invisible gases also have to obey certain natural laws which we discovered by different scientists. Robert Boyle, an Anglo-Irish physicist, found a relationship between pressure and volume of gases. Boyle's law states that if you take a balloon filled with air and try to squeeze it with your hands, you will see its size decreasing. Technically, for ideal gases, pressure is inversely proportional to volume at constant temperature and mass of gas, which means if you increase pressure, the volume will decrease. If you draw a graph of PV is equal to K at particular temperature, it will be a hyperbola. If you draw the graph at various temperatures, you can see a set of hyperbolas. Have you ever noticed that when you run in winter mornings, it is difficult to breathe? There is nothing physically wrong with us. The reason behind this is the decrease in our lung capacity in winters. Jack Charles, a prominent French scientist in the year 1780, proposed that at constant mass and pressure, volume of a gas is directly proportional to temperature, which basically means that ratio of volume versus temperature is always constant. We can plot a linear y is equal to mx graph to visualize this phenomenon, which states volume is directly proportional to temperature. Therefore, in winters, since the temperature is low, volume of your lungs decreases. As you must have noticed, that we breathe very heavily after running or dancing or any hard physical activity. Our lungs size increases, enabling us to inhale more oxygen, which is required for producing more energy. Avogardo, a famous Italian scientist, stated that at constant temperature and pressure, volume is directly proportional to number of moles, which means the ratio of volume number of moles is constant. These three laws proposed by Boyle, Avogardo and Charles combined together to create ideal gas equation. This equation can be alternatively written as P is equal to N upon V RT or P is equal to C RT where C is the concentration of gas. We all feel pressure before the exams. We generally say, I am bad at math. I am okay with physics but I am very good at chemistry. So the pressure which we feel before the exam is sum total of the pressures exerted by each subject. Similarly, when we talk about pressure exerted by air or a mixture of gases, it is sum total of all the individual pressures of the gases in the mixture. Suppose you are standing in the middle of two friends. One of them is holding a bottle filled with pungent smelling ammonia and the other is holding a sweet smelling bottle filled with perfume. If they both spray at the same time, which smell will you feel first? It is pungent or sweet. Why? Don't come to any conclusions yet. Let me introduce Graham's law of diffusion before you decide. Diffusion is a phenomenon which we see while spraying a perfume. Movement of molecules is always from higher concentration to lower concentration. Thomas Graham stated that at constant temperature and pressure, rate of diffusion is inversely proportional to square root of molecular mass of gas. We will learn more about gas in our next topic. Please like, share and comment on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more interesting and educational videos to earn while you learn.
Download Extra Class app from Google Play Store and get rewarded for studying.